Hey, it's Linda Perry, and um, I was asked to talk a little bit about John Lennon and Imagine, and it's hard because, you know, it's one of the greatest songs ever written, and you just instantly feel healed when you hear it. So emotional and so true. And we're talking about an artist that you can tell his intention was to make a difference with his art, with his words, with his songs, and the intention to heal. John Lennon's Imagine is one of the most inspirational songs that has ever been created. And the one thing I really love is that these days they are finally giving credit to Yoko Ono. Even John Lennon said that Yoko was such a big part, especially of the lyrics of Imagine. She was the one that really brought John into more of a spiritual thinking about what we do affects the whole world and how if you imagine the world and become the change you want to see, then that's how you change the world. And that was Yoko's influence on John Lennon and you can hear it and imagine. Um, I think John Lennon is the guy that I would want to hang out with um, just because I feel like you'd have like, you'd definitely have a good time. You'd have, I, I don't I don't think he'd sit around talking about music all day. I think he would just probably like joke around with you and make fun of you and, and um, keep you on your toes intellectually for a while. I think he really showed people the other side of being a pop star, a rock star, you know, and, and he did it like warts and all, his faults, his lost weekend. And I just admire the guy. Uh, the evolution of John Lennon was pretty severe and amazing. And through it all, he was just a person. And, you know, just a small person could write a song like Imagine and change the world and change people's thoughts. And, and that's why I want to be in music and, you know, not that I'll ever write something like Imagine, but um, in my uh, glacial, smaller way, I can, you know, maybe uh, even just by being myself, turn someone's uh, thoughts around. And that is, um, I think what John Lennon drove to do and, and did, and uh, he changed our minds. And uh, it was like mind games, my prize John Lennon merch. Anyway, thank you for listening to me today, and uh, imagine, listen to it, love it, enjoy. There was so much happening in the world. Um, a lot of strife, a lot of tension, a lot of threats to the establishment, and people like John Lennon and the counterculture were essentially questioning and challenging a lot of the institutions and societal norms that until that point leaned heavily on the pillars of the establishment. I feel the lyrics are more important than ever. It was written from the standpoint of someone who was highly enlightened and uh, uh, had the ability to convey profound ideas with an elevated level of consciousness and the simple and beautiful philosophy that John put into that song uh, resonates to this day and it's just it's amazing hey I'm AJ from lit uh, it's crazy that uh, today we're talking about the song imagine by the legendary John Lennon um, on a day like today at a time like now when the world needs a song like this um, more than ever I feel like um, we're back to you know, needing unity and, and not just worldwide, but uh, in America. I think it's the first time I've ever seen anything like what's going on where we need Americans to come back together and, you know, be good to each other. Monday, September 6th, Access TV honors the 50th anniversary of John Lennon's masterwork, Imagine, with a double feature, Imagine John Lennon and Imagine the Film. Monday, September 6th on Access TV. Hey there, thanks for watching Access TV. Subscribe, follow, like, and do all the good stuff. And make sure you leave a comment below. I don't know, just let us know what your favorite Access TV show is, or who your favorite bands are, and what artists you're into, or just say hi, man. I'd like to be told hi. We love hearing from you, that's the point, all right? Keep it coming.